Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and yesterday I made a video on this uh, angel or fairy swinging on a swing, and we talked about making the wings so they wouldn't be so fragile. And then somebody on Facebook suggested or sent me an email off the video just to bring the swing down and attach that foot, which somebody else had I actually already talked about. So with your shape tool, grab or select your swing, holding down the Alt button, and you get your freehand shaping tool. They'll select all those nodes, and then just grab one of those nodes and put it down. And you then you can take and take your virtual segment delete key and delete those lines, and then that'll be one piece. But I wasn't going to make a video just for that. But I thought I'd bring this up. The Alt key gives you your freehand shape tool. Let's say by chance you grab one node too many. Let's do that on purposely. I'm going to hold down the Alt key. I'm going to grab all these. And I'm also going to grab that one that I do not want. With your Shift key, you can take that one out of the picture. Now, it only allows you to take out that one. If you need to take out more, let's do it again. I'm holding down the Alt key. And let's get two nodes. The Shape tool, or the Shift, Shift key, will only take away one. It won't take away the second one. And there's a reason for that. So if you hold down the Control button, it'll take away that one. And then you've got just your swing grabbed. So the control button will deselect nodes. The, sh the shift key, what the shift does, and it's pretty cool, this is just a straight line that's been converted to a curve, and I put a bunch of nodes on it. And you can see the arrow. Matter of fact, I'm going to make it bigger. I'm going to go to Tools, Customization, Nodes, and Handles, and I'm going to make them larger so you can see them on the video. Now, see the arrow key is pointing this way. Let's select all the nodes. And with the shift key, holding down the shift key, it's going to delete the nodes past that node, past that node toward the end of the arrow. It only works in that direction. So if you want to select, let's select all the nodes again. And we just want to get rid of these two nodes. Click on this one with your shift key, and it'll delete anything that direction. It won't delete it that direction. So let's do it with a circle. Our shift, our arrows this way is coming in this way. So if we grab, let's just grab all the nodes. And holding down the shift key, it's going to delete all these nodes on this side of that. Toward the end of the arrow. So the end, this is the start of the arrow. This is the end of the arrow coming this way. So let's do that again. Let's grab it. Hold down the, select them all, and let's just get rid of all the nodes except for that one and that one. It, it deleted or it deselected, and then you could move these two nodes. Now the control button, hold down the control button, and you can deselect every other one. The shift key will help you delete a lot of nodes in one direction where the control key will help you select nodes to deselect them. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.